Hello YouTube, my name is Froyolan and welcome to another episode of Lifestyle and Sneakers. Today we're going to do a uh, late unboxing of the Adidas Night Jogger in core black. So stick around. Before we continue with the video, may I just remind you that our Epic Air Jordan giveaway is still ongoing. We're giving away 6 Air Jordan sneakers to 6 lucky subscribers. And we actually already given away three of the Air Jordans and we're closing in on the fourth one. So please help us uh, reach our milestone so we can uh, give away these sneakers. In 1979, uh, Adidas released the original uh, Night Jogger. Uh, it was designed to enhance visibility for those runners that do their running during uh, dawn, dusk, or even nighttime. And this year, Adidas gave us an updated version of the Night Jogger. The first colorway released uh, last January 12, 2019. Uh, we got our pair around that time, but uh, since we don't have a channel yet, so we weren't able to uh, unbox it. And uh, we were caught uh, in the hype of the, uh, the releases, the Yeezys, the Jordan, so we weren't able to uh, uh, review it for you guys. But uh, we'll do a late unboxing now. So uh, here it is. So let's open it. Now let's look at the shoe. Uh, let's start with the upper. First thing you'll notice is uh, this version of the Night Jogger is uh, completely different from the original one. So maybe aside from the name. Anyway, uh, for this color it's dominantly black and with hits of orange and uh, uh, 3M reflective or reflective material. They used uh, premium materials for this one. You have on this part, on the toe area, they use suede. Also in the lace loops area. On the forefoot area, you have a uh, uh, woven mesh material uh, in com combination of black and gray. And on the lateral and medial side, it's made out of this uh, synthetic uh, ripstop material which is uh, very light and very durable and then you have the tree type logo overlay uh, with a, a stitch outline stitching uh, in uh, black so it's black on black for the tree stripes at the heel area it's uh, it's padded but not too thick uh, you have a mesh material uh, there's no there's uh, little support on the heel cup so it's uh, quite for a heel cup it's uh, soft then you have uh, a fluorescent uh, orange here uh, TPU overlay and uh, fluorescent here synthetic leather fluorescent orange and that what gives it the, the night jogger uh, the night jogger moniker so it's the high visibility during uh, night time so fluorescent and the reflective material here and on the laces now the tongue part is made out of nylon and it has the exposed foam which I don't like for this particular shoe or colorway so that's just my uh, personal uh, opinion and you have uh, the streets uh, the Adidas uh, branding here on a suede uh, tongue pad so that's it for the upper. Now for the midsole, uh, it's made out of this uh, fan favorite uh, material, the boost. It's full length boost here and it's color black. So uh, there's no yellowing that will occur on this colorway. And then on the heel part, you have this uh, heel, heel support because the heel cup is like very soft. Uh, will be, uh, won't give you stability on the upper, but they made it up uh, on the midsoles. They gave you this uh, material here 
to lock down your heel so you don't slip and slide around. Uh, your foot will, won't slip and slide inside the shoe. And uh, on the outsole, it's made out of uh, rubber. Uh, there's uh, four colors. Uh, purple, black, orange, and this uh, milky mint color, uh, which at first uh, look, I thought it was uh, glow in the dark, but it's not. So, there you go. Overall, uh, I think this is a very good lifestyle sneaker. It's not a uh, performance running sneaker. First, uh, they gave you uh, premium materials for the upper. Then, they gave you uh, a full length boost, which is very comfortable. Uh, you have a good outsole. Uh, the color is uh, very, it's very good, but uh, I am not uh, a big fan of this colorway, right? Uh, this one is this is the first uh, colorway on this uh, night jogger line and uh, as of now there's a lot of colorways that you can choose from so uh, I prefer the white ones anyway the detail that I don't like on this shoe is the exposed foam on the tongue uh, it's just not cohesive with the overall look of the shoe and uh, even the original one doesn't uh, doesn't have the exposed uh, foam on the top. And for me, even though I like off-white, this one is a little uh, too off-whitey for me. So uh, anyway, that's just my opinion. So you can comment down below on what do you think on uh, on this shoe and. Uh, if you like it or not, if you like other colors, so please uh, use the comment section down below. I hope you like this video and if you do, please press the thumbs up button down below. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please press the subscribe button. Also, please uh, like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Again, my name is Froyland. Until next time.